Hello, I'm Andy Zaccaro. I would like to take a few minutes and walk through the simple steps it takes to set a modular knife assembly. If you follow these steps, you're going to get consistent, clean cuts. The first thing you do in order to set a set of knife assembly and, and blades is you have to be absolutely sure that there's nothing connected to the unit for safety. The blade is now just being held on by these two screws and I also always recommend that you replace the locking nuts. Uh, the locking nuts are anti-vibration devices built into it that keeps the screws from vibrating loose. So I'll put the second, the last screw in here and I'll just catch the threads on these here. The nuts on the back are captured so you don't need a wrench that actually holds itself from spinning. It also makes it so that the knife has a lower profile and doesn't take as much space. Okay, so everything is just loose. Nothing is set. And the first thing I do is I tighten the first screw next to the knife shoe so that the movable blade is parallel with the stationary blade. Okay, so now you can see that the movable blade is parallel with the stationary blade. Then what I do is we lower the knife assembly so that the contact point of the movable blade is directly in line with the second screw. And in order to be sure that I'm making contact, I put a piece of paper there as a gauge so that I know when I've tightened the screw enough. There, I just captured it. So once I've just caught the paper, I go a, an eighth of a turn more. And now I move down to the next position. Again, I'll tighten the screw until the paper is captured. Okay, I just ca captured the paper. Now I go a quarter of a turn more. Okay, that's all that's required to set a knife assembly. Should you have a larger knife assembly with more screws, you would just continue that process all the way down for the whole process of the knife assembly. So at this point, we've set the knife. If you notice when the knife is closed, there's a very, very small gap here, probably one or two business cards, and that on this end, the blade is, is in direct contact. That's creating a pure shearing action for our knife assembly. And just to be sure that it's set properly, we're going to cut some saran wrap. Saran wrap is extremely stretchy and hard to cut. Unless you can, if blades are set properly, you're not going to be able to cut your material. And here, we've just cut the saran wrap.